and the 2017 IFP Gotham Award for Best Documentary goes to Strong Island. Jans Ford director, Jans Ford, Jocelyn Barnes producers. So uh, some folks are allergic to the teleprompter. I apparently am allergic to paper, and this is not that heavy. <laughs> thank you to Joanna Vicente, to IFP, thank you. This Gotham Award is thrilling for us as we believe um, it's like coming home. When Strong Island was in the spotlight on documentaries in 2012. 2012. And here we are in 2017. Thank you, IFP, for helping to build the community and support so many artists um, who have been here and who have been where we were. Thank you. To all of the DOC nominees, we are, we are humbled to be in your presence and you are examples for us as we compete and support one another. Thank you for doing the incredible work that you do. I love the Gotham Awards. I love the nod to William, to Washington Irving's depiction of the crazy, crafty New Yorkers, and of course, the instant evocation of the brooding city of Bruce Wayne. We want to firstly thank Netflix and our executive producers there, Jason Spengarnkoff and Lisa Nishimura, and their team who have been incredibly supportive and responsive partners in distributing Long Island. Ted, you and your people are a miracle. Thank you. Our stellar executive producers, Danny Glover, Susan Rockefeller, Tony Tbotnik, Michelle Moret, and Laura, and Laura Poitras. Our major funders, Just Films at the Ford Foundation, the John D. and Catherine T. MacArthur Foundation, the Sundance Documentary Film Program, Sundance Catalyst, Sundance Institute, the Danish Film Institute, Cinereach, the Bertha Foundation, Field of Vision, Chicken and Egg, Forked Films, Lisa Kleiner Chanoff, Linda Wyman, Barbara Gopkin, the Drome Foundation, Chaz Ebert, Fledgling, Funder, Fledgling Fund, and others. That's how many funders it takes to get this director to the finish line. <laughs> to get this producer who squeezed blood from a stone after almost 10 years in production. This producer changes careers. Her name is Jocelyn Barnes. You should all know who she is. <laughs> to our brilliant crew, my endless thanks to all of you, especially our director of photography, Alan Jacobson, I know you are watching. Our editor, Janis Biliskov Jensen, and assistant editor, Valtteri Van Hannen, the Norwegian, I know you are watching. Composers, Hildur Gudnadotter and Craig Sutherland, I know you are watching. Co-producer, Sina Sorensen, and the team at Final Cut for Real in Copenhagen, I know you are watching. And my producer, Jocelyn Barnes, and her producing partner, Danny Glover, at Louverture Films, thank you for every single hard-fought step of this journey. Thank you. And to my partner, Amanda Lichtenberg, who is my heart and the beat of my heart, thank you. You are my rock. My profound thanks to the people who appeared in this film to tell their story, especially my family and especially my mother who has been dead for five years Saturday and who comes alive for me in this room tonight. You should all know her. She is worth knowing. She is worth listening to. There is nothing exceptional about the family in Strong Island. Hard work did not spare this family from the unrelenting systemic violence that has stalked black Americans since the founding of this nation. They did not survive. 
My family did not survive. That destruction is what should be exceptional, but it is not. In 1992, 11,175 black men were murdered in the United States. But that number does not include my brother because his death was not a crime. In fact, it's impossible to know how many other homicides are not included in that number. The profound fear woven into our justice system makes a mockery of due process. Explanations like, I was afraid for my life, or simply, I was afraid, are enough to have wiped countless numbers of people from FBI statistics. They are enough to wipe people from our lives. Uninterrogated fear combined with proven systemic racial bias mean that the entire family, entire families, disappear. There is a direct line through history onto which my brother falls, but he is like any young man on the streets of Gotham tonight. William Ford Jr. was never meant to survive. Look around this room and know that many people here were never meant to survive. Strong Island reclaims one family's narrative from history, and we hope to shatter this narrative for the future. Thank you.